Hey, what's up, everybody? I got a quick story time to share with you. This was around the early 2000s. My mother at the time was very active in the church. And she came to me one day and asked if I would come and support her because she was tasked by her pastor to be in charge of the very first Woman's Day event. My mother also asked my sisters, some other family members and friends. And naturally, that's my mother. I wanted to support her. I agreed that I would come. And so did my sister and some other family members, right? So we go to the service, which was about two or three weeks later. And the service was really well put together. My mother did an outstanding job. So after the service, my mother made her way over towards me with her pastor. He enthusiastically reached out his hand and said, oh, so you are Anthony. Your mother spoke so much about you. She speaks very highly of you, that you're a singer and you are a musician. And then he said, so what church do you go to? And without a thought, without hesitation, I immediately said, between these two temples here, he went, uh, 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 uh. my mother was looking at me like, I cannot believe this. My sister was standing there snickering, was trying to hold it together. And as the pastor was struggling to find the right words to say, I see a uh, elder usher female flip over and fall on the floor. Her legs went up in the air and I immediately went over to help her. And the pastor saw where I was going and they all saw this woman on the floor. We helped her off the floor, made sure she was okay. Needless to say, that pastor didn't say another word to me. I was never invited to another event and my mother never uttered a word about that experience. The moral of the story is sometimes when you speak from the heart, Heart within a space that is not used to truth or authenticity, it could truly be earth shaking and tongue tying, literally and figuratively. Keep it growing and flowing, y'all.